Okay, so your name is Richard. That's right. And uh, so tell me where you're from originally, Richard. I grew up in the San Fernando Valley. You're kidding. I grew up in the valley too. Yeah. You're a valley boy. That's right. <laughs> wow. Valley, so um, can I, do you mind if I ask just briefly how you ended up on the streets? Uh, Panhandling? I ended up on the streets. Uh, drugs. 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 And, drugs and alcohol. Um, are you in any kind of a rehab program or are you... I am not. No. Ah. Uh, no. Okay. So where do you sleep at night? On the street. Really? Yeah. Well, now, if you don't mind me saying, you, you're very clean and well-groomed. How do you stay clean and well-groomed? <laughs> uh, the, the resources in downtown LA on Skid Row, there's no reason for anybody to be walking around dirty or unshaved. Really? Yeah. I mean, there's plenty of food, there's plenty of uh, resources to take a shower, there's clothes, yeah. So you're saying it's, it's really not hard to stay clean and well-groomed. I always thought that it would be really difficult. So there's places for you to shower and shave and... Yeah, there's three places to shower and shave. I mean, you look like you shaved this morning. I did. Wow. <laughs> so do you sleep at the missions? Um, I sleep in the courtyard of the mission. Oh, wow. Yeah. How is that for you? Uh, I mean, it's rough. Rough, but uh -huh. it's, uh, it's a hole that I've dug for myself. I'm laying. Do you do you ever see yourself getting out of that hole? Uh, I do. I, I'm getting tired of this, and it's getting old. And it's getting old real quick. How long have you been living this life down here like this? Uh, it's only been about 46, 47 days. Really? Yeah. Wow. Is there anything you want to say on camera about how you're feeling today, or... <laughs> I know when I, when I first came up to you, it looked like you weren't having too much luck with people. Is that hard, getting rejected constantly? It is. It is. You know, and it, it's not being rejected, but it's like uh, the fact that nobody even... Like, when somebody walks by and they don't even acknowledge that you're saying, excuse me, sir. Right. Uh, well, can I just give you my own little perspective as someone who lives downtown? Sure. I get approached so many I times bet. that it's n don't take it personally when I don't acknowledge you. It's just that we get approached so many times. I understand. There are so many people yeah. downtown. Yeah. But, you know, I, there's something about you. I just wanted to stop and interview. I really appreciate that. I wish I had more money to give you. That's but, all right. Um, so uh, thank you very much.